Welcome back to another mini episode of What's the Tea with Dr. Hendrix. That's me and Gabriel D. Me. And Lava Lee. Her. We are, <laughs> we are back today to discuss a great question that was actually left in the comments below. And that is, what should patients expect to see within 6 to 12 weeks of starting testosterone replacement therapy? So that 2 to 3 month mark. Of course, you're going to expect to see some changes happen if your treatment is appropriate and you're on a good dosage. But before doing any of that and getting into that important information, if you're out there concerned you may have symptoms of low testosterone or looking to get screened, we are happy to help you at HendrixHealth.com. We're going to put a link in the description of this video where you can find more information on how to set up a free consultation to discuss your symptoms with me. If lab screening is appropriate, we do offer it right now. We're running a special with our lab partner, LabCorp, $150 for a full assessment of all those important biochemicals and hormones that could be contributing to how you feel. Typically, those results come back in just a couple days. We set up a follow-up to review together. And if treatment is appropriate, we can get you started to feeling better. So again, there'll be a link in the description of this video. If you have additional questions, leave them in the comments below. But what do you think patients are going to expect to see in about 6 to 12 weeks after starting testosterone replacement therapy? Hold on. A free consultation with you? I want one too. <laughs> you get a free consultation every day. Mm. But I like the segue. <laughs> I expect patients to feel pretty good after 6 weeks of therapy. Yeah. So after about 6 to 12 weeks of testosterone replacement therapy, you should expect to see more physical changes. In that first initial month, as we talked about in another video, you're going to start to see more mental changes, increasing that libido, feeling more energized motivated, especially first thing in the morning. But physical changes are typically going to start within that two to three month window. You're going to start to see an increase in lean muscle mass. So you may notice that body weight actually increased slightly because muscle is heavier than fat. And you're also going to notice an increase in stamina and endurance at the gym. So if you're already physically fit and working out in the gym, you're going to probably feel like you can lift heavier, right. maybe stay in the gym longer. And if you're not quite on that journey yet, you may feel more inspired to get into the gym again because you're going to feel more strong and have more energy uh, to stay at the gym longer. Yeah, you've got to have that energy to get a good workout. Exactly. So you should start seeing those improvements and more physical changes. You may also start to see a decrease in body fat, feeling more slim. So that's why I always tell patients, monitor your progress in the mirror instead of the scale because body fat is not going to be as heavy and lean muscle mass is going to be quite heavy. So it's going to be interesting to see on the scale in comparison to what you look like. So you should, again, start to see those physical changes around that time. But if you're not noticing those improvements, that's the time to reach out to your doctor because we typically would reassess your labs about 90 days in and adjust your dosage to make sure that you're able to continue to see that progress that you're looking for. That's the beauty of telemedicine. You can see patients conveniently and check their labs when necessary. Exactly. So we're able to really be on top of your progress and ensure you're getting the most out of your treatment. So again, if you have concerns for low testosterone, please reach out to us. We'd be happy to help get you screened and get you started on treatment if necessary. And if you have other questions regarding testosterone replacement therapy or low T, put them in the comments below. We'd love to assess those for you, get some answers to you. And thank you so much for joining us on this very mini episode of What's the Tea? If you haven't watched the other videos yet, please take a look. We have many, many others. <laughs> and like, subscribe, share if you haven't yet. Thank you for watching again. And we'll see you next time. We'll see you next week. Bye.